Hello friends, welcome back to my trading channel. Today we are going to discuss about technical level for some stocks. The first stock is RO Pharma. So now RO Pharma is trading near the support level. 712 and 707 level is the strong support. And we can buy, uh, take buy at this level. Okay. And this is the resistance level. So once market is break below 707 level, then it's a bearish trend, downtrend. Now it's a bullish trend. Once it's touch this level, 712 and 707, we can buy this out of pharma stock. Next stock is Glenmark. Now Glenn market recently break the resistance level and trading above the resistance. Now this level act as a strong support. 523 and 518 level is a strong support. So when market is touch this level, 523 and 518 level, you can buy Glenmark. And if it breaks below 518 level, then only go for sell. And we are following 50 minutes candlestick time frame. If the candle is closing above this level, then going for buy. Below this level, going for sell. The next stock is Lupin. Okay, Lupin also trading near the support level. 944 and 940 is the support level. So once market is touch this level, uh, you can take buy Lupin. Okay, uh, it will change to move the next level. And if the if Lupin is break this level and trade below 940 level, then go for sell. So this is the strong support level now. So market may change to touch and then retrace back. So just watch this strong support level. Once it's close below 940 level and trade below this level, then only it's downtrend. Next stock is Biocon. Biocon is trade inside the triangle pattern now. So once it's break this triangle pattern, it stands to move the next level. Next resistance level is 369 and 371 level and support is 355 and 352 level. If market is breaks below and touch this level, then you can buy this Biocon stock. It will change to move next level. And if it breaks below 952 level, then only go for sell. The last stock is iBull Housing Finance. iBull Housing Finance is also trading near the support level 238 and 235 level. In between this level, it's a strong support. So once market is trade in, in between this level, you can take buy iBull Housing Finance. And if market is breaks below this level, 235 level, then only go for sell. Now it's near to the support level. If it's touch and it's showing a retracement, you can take by Ibull Housing Finance. I will give all this chart link on the comment box so it will be easy for you. You just click the link and you will get the chart. Okay, let's discuss about previous uh, technical level performance. So these are the levels I given. So just check one by one. Godrej CP. Okay. Uh, from 27th. Let's see what will be happen. So after 27, you can see it goes and touch the trend line, this trend line. Then it comes down, see. And it's take a support at the 1008 level, see. The same level, 1008 level. Then it's going up. Again, it comes down. So the level is working perfect, you can see. The same level I given here, 1008. So Godrej CP is working perfect as per our technical level. The next level I given Apollo Hospital. 4688 level is the strong support level, 4641, let's see. After 27, it's first can itself, it's break the support level and you can see the candle is closing below the level. 
Now it is a sell trend. After that it comes down. See, it is not break the level again. See. So it is working Apollo Hospital also. As per our strategy, 50 minutes candle is closing below the level. We are going for sell above the level, going for buy. So we got a sell signal here and it comes down. Apollo Hospital, you can see. The stock is Good Gas Limited. Okay, this is the level Good Gas Limited. So 642 and 637 is the resistance and you can see after 27 it touched the resistance level and comes down again touch the same resistance level again it comes down see it didn't break the resistance level so whenever market is touch this level and the candle is closing below the level we can go for sell now it's take a support at the trend level you can see here so this level working good gas limited also next one icicgi 1565 and 1558 the support level Now you can see here market is take support at that level again goes up again comes down and again support at that level and goes up and here candle is closing below the level see so it's a sell trend now it's a selling trend and you can see it comes down again going up and again comes down now none of the candle is closing above the level if the candle is closing above the level then only go for buy now it's a sell because it's break the support and candle is 50 minutes candle is closing below the level then go for sell see, you can see here candle is touching above uh, just touch the level and candle a green candle is closing above the level then buy here also you can see 50 minutes candle is closing above the level and it's going up Based on this level, you can trade future and options also. The final one, AU Bank. AU Bank 1070 and 1064 is the support level on 27th. Uh, let's see. See. 1070 and 1064. The level, support level, 27th. See. Exact that level, it touched the support. None of the candy is closing below the level and here candy is closing above. After that you can see it's going up. See 190 points is going up from that the buy level. So our technical level is working perfect. So those who are following this level hope they are making money. Based on these levels, you can trade future and options and equity stocks also. Hope you like this video. And if you have any doubt, do send a mail to nicolasnilo2017 at gmail.com. Also visit my website nicolasnilo.com. And if you wish to join my telegram channel, just search Nicholas Nilo on your telegram. Thank you. Thank you for watching. I will be back with another trading strategy video. Till then, have a nice day. Bye-bye.